Philippe, I think you have a stack of papers to show the audience, don't you? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. So here is the stack of papers. I know I made that YouTube video, and this is all the papers that can be found on the iohk.io portal. You just go to the paper section, and I printed all of these. It's double sided. I'm not, I know people are going to say it's a waste. But I'm getting a binder and I'm putting it in my room and every time they release a new paper, I am going to print it out like this new paper that came out that Sebastian tweeted the other day. Um, I don't know if everyone can see it, but it was comparing block times for different consensus algorithms. So Sebastian, I don't know if you wanted to add because you did respond in a tweet. Um, I don't have all the papers printed because not all the papers are, are there. And um, I didn't include some papers, so the stack should be actually a lot higher. Um, so it, it's it's very heavy, eight pounds, eight pounds. I weighed it out. So um, yes. So anyone, you know, I know there's a whole debacle going on right now with Ethereum and then their delay. This is what you need to do to build something correctly. You know, you should be writing novels. This is what gives people the instruction manuals <laughs> to build it correctly. So, um, yeah, I don't know if anyone wanted to add anything to that, but yeah, yeah, Philippe, uh, I'm glad you're saving that because I am a tree hugger and we're going to save this for the history books and continue to build that stack higher and higher. And you know how guys are, you know, they like to measure things and compare things. And so if any else, anyone else out there from, with different cryptocurrencies, if you would like to send in your papers to measure up and see how it stacks up against the Cardano, feel free to do so. Um, we'll leave you a link. And if you make personal contact, you know, we'll get we'll give you a location to mail those papers in. Does that sound good, Philippe? That sounds great. You know, I've, I've looked at other cryptocurrency projects. I can't find any papers. So when I'm comparing it, it's hard to compare something with nothing. So, but if you do have a cryptocurrency project out there that you're concerned about, send over the papers and we will compare. And I have a tape measure. We can weigh it. We can we can put the tape measure up. And so a lot of these papers, they have been peer reviewed and they've been submitted to the, the top of the line crypto conferences. So they're just not papers just being written from some random person in their bedroom. People are actually looking at these papers and critiquing them and it's the industry leaders that are doing that so there's there's definitely a process involved in this oh you mean industry leaders are reviewing those papers they just you just don't post it on the internet and your buddies hit like and exactly oh yeah it's exactly peer -reviewed. exactly peer review doesn't mean that you take it to your dad and you say dad did i write a good paper no it's someone independent that has probably been working in this industry their entire lives that is probably more academically advanced in that field than the person actually writing the paper in some cases and they're looking and critiquing every single thing that you submit so they need to definitely be peer reviewed in order for them to have any substance you can't just write papers and say um that it, it's correct because who can verify I can't verify. I'm not a software engineer. I need someone to to verify that's actually within this industry.